Hello guys, welcome back to Top Home Guide. Today I am going to talk in this video about Best 5, Fridge for Truckers, that you should buy. Let's do started. Number 1 the Edge Star line of 12 volt DC portable fridge freezers are the perfect companion for road trips and camping. With a full range digital thermostat that can be set from negative 8 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, these units can operate as either a refrigerator or freezer. Included are cables for both AC and DC power, and the cooler can run off standard household voltage or easily connect to the cigarette lighter in your car. These units are available in 43, 63, and 80 quart capacity, which gives you plenty of space to keep essential items on hand and chilled at the necessary temperature. The compressor-based cooling system freezes quickly and the fast freeze button cools the compartment down to negative 8 degrees Fahrenheit in a matter of minutes. Even if the power fails, the insulated walls and lid of the unit will keep the contents cold for quite some time. Two removable wire baskets are included for efficient storage and the side grip comfort handles make the fridge easy to move as needed. Take an Edge Star 12 volt portable fridge on the road with you and you'll never be able to use an ordinary cooler ever again. Number 2 Portable Refrigerator for Car Home RV Camping So if you're like me and you like to go out on day trips or weekend trips by yourself, overnight trips with just you and your spouse or maybe a kid, I think this right here is the perfect solution. I've had this for about a month now. I've been using it on a couple different trips and I call it my one fridge because it's perfect for one person, maybe for one night or for one weekend. I love this little guy. Now I'll be honest, when I got this, I thought, okay, this has got to be a joke. This thing could not be practical. And oh, was I wrong. This is the 12 liter fridge by Joy Tutus. J-O-Y-T-U-T-U-S, Joy Tutus. I don't know if I'm saying that right or not. It's kind of fun to say, Joy Tutus. But honestly, it's perfect. It's a great little fridge and it fits you know, in the front seat. It fits easily in the back seat, slides in the back of my Jeep with all my stuff. I use this on my trip to uh, Big Brutus and checking out where the Big Iron Overland Rally is gonna be coming up in May. You need to check that out. Um, <laughs> this thing was awesome. I had a six pack of Cokes in here. I had bacon and eggs and mustard and mayonnaise and lunch meat, everything I was gonna need for the evening dinner and snacks and breakfast the next day and lunch the next day, it was perfect. So less than the high-end ice chest that will barely hold this much with all the ice you have to put in there to keep your stuff closed. And this will not only work as a fridge, but you can take it down to zero degrees and use it as a freezer if you need to. That's fantastic. So if you're like me and you have you know, a Dometic CFX50 and you don't have a freezer, but maybe you need a freezer for something when you're going on a longer trip, I mean, with the size of this thing, you can use your Dometic or, you know, your other big fridge in the back of your rid and throw this in the back there too to keep stuff frozen. How incredible is that? So how much is 12 liters actually practical for? Well, right now I've got it filled up with 13, 13 cans and there's still room for, for more. I could fit 15 cans in here easily. I could probably squeeze a couple more in there, but plenty of drinks for, you know, a day out fishing or, or, you know, or taking it hunting or just on a day trip, whatever. Um, but take some of the cans out. You've got room for, for your lunch meat, sandwiches to keep cold, um, condiments, all kinds of things. This honestly is the perfect little fridge. I think it's well designed. I mean, it's, it's plastic. It's you're not going to drop it off a, a cliff or you know roll your Jeep and this survive probably. But it does great. It doesn't draw a lot of power. It's actually on right now. Um, I've got it plugged into the Jackery 1000, and it's pulling 30 watts. Not bad at all, because the compressor's on. We'll be putting these, these drinks in there. Um, it's got a great little super simple display where you can change the temperature up and down. It's very just touch sensitive. Apparently got it set on 33 degrees. It's got two modes. It's got a max mode, which it's in right now uh, to get these drinks cool real fast. And it's got an eco mode. So it lowers the compressor a little bit and doesn't you know, chill things off super quick. So once you've got everything chilled out, throw it into eco mode. I actually put this in the back of my rig uh, for the big British trip. I had it plugged into a little 500 watt power station and just let it run. And it didn't die until late Sunday night. So four, over four days running off of a 500 watt battery uh, power station. That's pretty awesome. Uh, I mean, it's, it's super simple. I absolutely love this thing. And for 180 bucks, it's perfect. 
Inside is quite simple. There is a nice rubber seal. So once you've got everything chilled down, you're not gonna lose your temperature. It does have a nice rubber seal. Um, it's got your, your specs here. Uh, there's no basket or anything, because honestly, it, it doesn't need one. It's just small enough to hold your stuff and easily get to it. The lid has a nice little seal to it, and you're not gonna accidentally pop it open. Um, so it's fantastic. It's got two, two carrying handles here, so you can move it around. It does have three voltage protections. So you've got a high, medium, low. So depending upon the battery in your rig, you can set it to bed whatever you know, voltage cutoff you want. And so this will protect your starter battery if that's all you're running, just like I am in my Jeep. I only have a single battery in there, so I've got it plugged in there. I do want to make sure that this does not drain my battery. But with as little power as this little guy draws, I don't think that's going to be an issue unless you're going to be parked for days. This is a brand new friends. The link just hit Amazon. The link is in the description below. Seriously, if you if you think carrying your big fridge is just too much for a day, um, if you want something smaller, if you don't have a fridge and you're tired of dealing with ice and you just go out for day trips or you know hunting and fishing, that sort of thing, give this guy a serious look. It does have a two-year warranty, which I think is actually pretty awesome for a fridge in this seriously budget category. And I love it. So let me know in the comments, what do you think about this little guy? I love the fact that they're offering little sizes like this. I mean, we're so used to the 45 liters, the 55 liters, the 65, 75 dual zones. So the fact that they're coming out with little 12 liter fridge freezers like this, I think is absolutely fantastic. I think it fills a niche that so far hadn't been addressed. Let me know in the comments what you think. I really like it. And I'm gonna use the heck out of this thing for my day trips and my, my solo weekend trips. Uh, I'm super pumped about this. If, if this was helpful to you, um, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. I've got a lot more reviews and stuff coming. I love doing these. I get lots of comments saying how helpful these are. So if you're like me, you want to do a lot of research before you're you know, spending the type of money on some of this gear that we do. And so I hope these are helpful. I appreciate you taking the time to watch this. Have a great day. Bye. Number three. Chefman Mini Portable White Personal Fridge. Cooling and warming with the flip of a switch. Set the fridge to either cool or warm to store your food and drinks the way you would like. Make sure you first unplug the fridge before switching settings. When switched to the cool setting, the food or drink being stored in the fridge must already be cold for the item to stay cool. For the warm setting, food must be warm slash hot before placing in the fridge. The fridge cools to 32 degrees Fahrenheit and warms up to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Number 4. Bouge RV23 Quart 12 Volts Portable Refrigerator Car Freezer Fridge. Warranty and certification, with CE and FCC certificated, we guarantee you a two-year warranty for the compressor and other accessories. If you have any questions, please reach out to Bouge RV. We provide 24 hours friendly customer service. Package included, DC power cord, AC power cord and user manual. 45 watts low power consumption, with eco energy saving mode, this 23 quart car fridge's operating power is less than 45 watts. Number 5. F40C4 TMP 12 volts portable car fridge. The 12V fridge has different modes for options including max, fast cooling, and eco, energy saving. The rated power is 45 watts, which means travel refrigerator consumes less than 1 kWh every day. You can plug in overnight without worrying about it will drain the car battery. The 12V camping refrigerator has different levels for battery protection, low, mid, and high, which prevents the battery from draining and reopen automatically when the voltage is restored. Thanks for watching. To receive every update please subscribe and click the bell icon below. For more information about this products check the video description.